Welcome back to the channel, everybody. We got another I'm Kevin video. Now, his recent video, I tried to upload it. It just was not going through. So that's on my second channel. It's going to be in the description. But we got Dan is wow. And also, we got beautiful ladies today. So clap it up right now. But let's get it. Let's go. Yeah, me. Uh, my socials are down below. You can follow me if you'd like. But um, this is my outfit check. <laughs> okay. That's why you say you want the fit check. I like that. I like that. Okay. <laughs> Guys, I'm Cassie. Um, you guys can follow me on TikTok. My link will be below. It's a blast W Cass X. Okay, all the ladies coming out. Okay. I know it's been a good minute since y'all got a short vid out of me, but this was a show I wanted to check out, so I might as well check it out with y'all. And it gives me a little break from the 40 minute vids. But yeah, I seen them trailers and it caught my eye. Now, first thing I gotta say is that opening is tough. <laughs> now first thing we see is homegirl arguing with her boyfriend now fellas you do not want to be like this guy this is what you call a bum asking your girl for money to take her out is diabolical work these are the type of guys who peak in high school 10 years later you're gonna try to get some mickey d's when you see them at the cash register oh man kev that's you remember me we went to the same school together have you ever seen somebody I used to go to school or work at McDonald's? Yes, of course. Yes. For real? Mm -hmm. Yes, all the time. I ain't never seen nothing like that. Have y'all in the comments? I ain't never seen nothing like that, though. <laughs> but how's it been? We are not friends, bro. Even back in school, we was at most associates. So they be trying to spark what? a full-blown convo like, bro, this is not what I came here for. The last thing I want to do at McDonald's is have a reunion. Just hand me my <laughs> nuggets, dude. But to make it even more Why weird, not? dude was like, oh, yeah, I can just take you to a love hotel. Ooh, I can't even blame her. Girl. She was going straight for the juggler. Mm -hmm. That guy's a weirdo. But it was to no avail. She got dropped immediately. Dang. So she has the class and her friends are clowning her goo. They told her not to Sorry. date that bum, but she still did it anyway. And her excuse was that he looked like Ken Takakura, whoever that is. But now that that's out the way, the f is that. What is this monstrosity on my screen? What is this not going to lie, you got to fight makeup. somebody. Your makeup, parents, <laughs> siblings, your so-called friends right behind you. They just let you walk in the house like that. Oh, with that on your no obviously friend, i don't care about you and you got the surprise face, on your desk like you did a good <laughs> job bro no nah, they ain't no real friend bro you can't have your friends walking out oh. this, like that though oh no the nerd that they doing their makeup in class it means a lot right there. they doing it in class bro. throw that shit away right. makeup could be cool just make sure it's not in your hands also on another note is this how <laughs> japanese people see us because there's times when they get us right they got better over the years but there's times when they fully despise us so she was walking the halls when she peeps these kids food and how bad does the be for the entire class to segregate they refuse to sit next to bro and why are you throwing paper like you're not sitting by yourself just like him they are not going to be friends with you bro you can cut it out and look at these bad kids throwing papers already crazy but putting a magnet in there is out of pocket where are the teachers at That's anime crazy. makes it seem like there's only three yeah. teachers in the entire school bro help him they getting creative now who just casually has a magnet in their pocket they gonna yeah. start smuggling in contraband next week but that's when homegirl sits next to him and all of them got in line but now she's back to waddling in the halls and i don't even know how bro got here instant transmission but he goes full dwee mode talking about how trump met up with aliens or something like that homegirl was like yeah i don't really care about ufos and stuff uh, actually they're called uaps unidentified aerial phenomena <laughs> i'm glad she walked away because he just kept going but her walking away must have not been a big enough hint Huh? I don't care. Leave me alone, you dweeb. The last thing I need what? is your dork ass shoving your weird books in my face. That's why you have no friends. You f but that guilt immediately kicked in. When you say something crazy, expecting them to fire back, but they don't, now you feel like a dickhead. Now you have to mm -hmm. apologize. Hey, I'm sorry. I don't believe aliens are real but I believe ghosts are. You believe in ghosts <laughs> at your grown age? You know, maybe he isn't that bad. Not I kind of like this guy. They was arguing about it and, ugh, this angle is way worse. Look like a damn 
trooper. So, so they made a deal that he has to go somewhere haunted, and if he sees a ghost, he becomes her servant. And the same goes for her. If she sees an alien, she becomes his servant. So what kind of deal is that, bro? The servant, if you see a ghost, yeah. alien? <laughs> Hey, they cussed her at the place and not gonna lie i thought this was a group project why are you here by yourself they're talking to each other on the phone it turns out bro was on a whole different map looking for ghosts huh? so you're both stupid map. never watched a horror movie before oh yeah she's doomed meanwhile bro was tweaking out and yelling in a tunnel when momo was like oh by the way ghosts don't like loud noises at least that's what they say online huh? oh so you're a fraud i'm not a fraud i told you my grandma's a medium She's the one who raised me. Both my That's parents are dead. Them. Damn, okay. Uh, I don't know why you felt the need to tell him that. Now, of all times, there's a time and a place and this was neither. Like, that information had no benefit on the convo at all. If anything, you made it awkward. Because what else can you say to that besides sorry? But I guess that was supposed to lead into her backstory. So when she was younger, her grandma had her doing this ritual pose for good luck. Doesn't matter where she was at, where she was going, she was told to do the mm -hmm. pose. But it got to the point where her okay. classmates started you know making fun of her. Yeah. Worst of all, her little crush was in on it too. And kids gonna be kids. Whoa. She told her grandma that she hates her and is never doing that pose again but she wasn't really mad about her little crush not liking her back she was more mad that her little crush was making fun of her grandma and all that was to say that she believes in ghosts because she loves her grandma and she believes in what she does then she was like now it's your turn to tell me why you believe in aliens uh shit i don't know they kind of cool so why not you know i kind of like this they're easy to talk to we should do this more up, often. Up. No. Damn, I must be too. Oh, what is that? Oh, oh no. What? If you let me gobble your dog. Oh, hell no. Man, what? I can already see the comments now. Hey, Kev, hear me out. No, keep your fetishes away from me. See, this guy got the right idea. That ghost motives are out of pocket. Like, you don't want to kill me or anything? Take over my body, perhaps? Why is your goal to be a freak? But unfortunately, running was pointless. Got hit with a domain expansion. And at that point, he was doomed. How scary. Yeah. But they're in this together. If one gets caught, so does the other. Got ran up on by three Mr. Beans. And not gonna lie. A lot of questionable activities is going on right now. She wakes up trapped in a chair, clothes torn, surrounded by these freak demons That's talking weird, about right? some. Look we like are that. funny well, species. Thinking. Unfortunately, we are all men, know. so we cannot reproduce normally. No. What is that? Bro, what, what is face? going on? You're Look at his face. Stop. You're lying. This man what? Gotta... Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is no. a good anime, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Bro. Boy, he's ecstatic. Happiest he ever been. And it's just getting freakier and freakier. They started using mm -hmm. psychic abilities to force a... I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't even know what to say. They're pushing boundaries, but not quite hitting the line yet. <laughs> Terrible timing. Your girl's busy. Your girl's busy. He Ooh, did not is, let that slide. Uh, Took that shit to yeah. heart. And climbing through a phone is cool as shit. Not even gonna lie. But the first oh thing God. he does. Mm -hmm. he oh, you oh. oh no. Shit, I ain't know Diddy had influence on other planets. Shaboy <laughs> going munching as oh, your primary God. attack is wicked work. Like on one hand, a yo. You had a lot of options there, but you choose to chomp on Shaboing Boing. But Shaboing on the other hand, that might have been a big brain play. Huh? If you think about it, you can take a couple punches to the face and be all right. But once you get hit below the belt, you're finished. And even if you do get back up, that's minus 30 to your strength, minus 45 on your speed, minus 58 to accuracy, minus 71 to intellect. Your armor broke, health is on 1 HP. It's really a downhill battle from there. I'm just saying that might have been a good strategy. Would I do it? Fuck no. I'd rather fight Batman himself than do that. My job was to recognize the game plan. I'm not the one on the court. Cause look, it did work. He's not getting up anytime soon. And Momo is a funny person. She sees bro, makes direct eye contact, sees his predicament, proceeds to say nothing along what? the lines of, oh, are you okay? Is that still you in there? She said, get me out of here now. And I respected every word. I'll check up on you when I'm safe. But then the Mr. Mm -hmm. Beans proceed to rip their skins off. And this episode must oh, be Shaboing Boing theme because they point. cannot stop talking about it. Give us your banana. Kill me. So homeboy dodges all their attacks, hits him with a jump scare, and ain't oh, no way. Yeah. 
the Shaboing Boing Bandit strikes again. He literally had a free headshot but still went for the jewels. That is insane. I really hope when he gets back in control, someone tells him about his nefarious acts. About to make a name for yourself for the wrong reasons. So he goes for the next one but gets shut down immediately. But that's when he had his main character moment. I don't care what you do to me. I never had any friends and I thought if anyone would, it will be aliens. I called out to you for years, but you never showed up. I got bullied nonstop and no one cared. But Momo was the only one who stood up for me. I won't let anyone hurt her. <laughs> Shut up, Goofy. Yeah, that's enough fighting for one day. But when one MC gets that power up, the other has to get one too. Yeah, and is that a flashback I see? Yeah, I'll go ahead and say they won this fight. She just learned how to release her chi. And she couldn't connect that kick earlier, so she said, fuck it, why not let it fly? And for a split second there, I thought she pulled off a crazy feat. Was about to say she can probably box with Naruto in them. But turns out she just kicked bro into his own whip. Homeboy still tweaking out though. He trying to catch as many bodies as possible. But she yeah. ends up pushing the freak lady out of his body. And before leaving, I kid you not, she says she swipe or no swiped his shaboing boing. Huh? And as long as she has it, he will be cursed. If you want it back, pull up to the tunnel. Let's fight you tacky little bitch. And that was word for word. I did not come up with that. And so much is going on. Now the UFO is about to crash into the building. I got no clue how they even got in there. And there's no point in questioning it. So now they're in a weird situation. First off, Momo lost her fit. She better hope grandma is asleep by the time she get back home. But if she stops using her power on bro, then he's going to transform again. So his game plan was to give Momo his clothes while he goes on the most important mission of his life, the Shaboing Boing Retrieval Arc. Now, obviously, she wasn't going to let him do that by himself. But this next line changed their whole dynamic. Sorry. I'm an awkward guy. Could you please put this on already? I'm worried I won't be able to think straight. Hey, if it works, it works. She likes the nerdy guys. But it was really because he happened to say one of Ken Takakura's lines. The same guy she was talking about earlier. I'm assuming he's an author and she reads his books or something like that. But to confirm, she was like, I never got your name. What did you say it was again? I'm Ken. Ken Takakura. Oh yeah, he got it. Now off the first episode, can't lie, that was pretty cool. The hey, thing that crazy. sells for me is mm -hmm. good characters. One I episode, think I'm gonna yeah. like the interactions in the show. Also, the art, the art is A1, makes my eyes happy. But the only problem I have is that we gotta wait a whole week for the next episode. Oh, oh my god. god. I gotta go check this out. What that was a good episode. Hey. What's this on? Uh, Netflix? I gotta go check that out later, man, if it's on Netflix, man. But that was crazy. Mm -hmm. you know, first episode, that was a lot of craziness. I'm a, I can't admit, ladies. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't even know what was going on, but just, I don't know. Yeah. That was crazy. It just, I just felt like it was like six episodes that we just went through. That's what I thought, too, though. The first episode like that is wow. But he got to make some more videos. I'm Kevin. Please make some more videos on this because that was actually funny. Mm -hmm. And that was good, though. Um, but if you guys enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe, go follow these beautiful ladies on social media, but peace out. Love you guys. Peace.